I didn't hear the shots the first time. I hear them all the time now. And I suspect I'm not alone. So many of us, whether Jewish or not, whether from Squirrel Hill or not, whether in Pittsburgh that morning or not, hear those shots still. They were the modern day shots heard around the world. The opening shots in our contemporary crisis of hurt and hate. Suspects talking about all these Jews need to die. I become frustrated about what I can do as an elected leader in a city that has now witnessed the worst anti-Semitic attack in American history. It's not just about anti-Semitism. It was an attack on America. Its foundation is hate. White supremacy, white nationalism, and racism are national security threats. The story of what's happened in Pittsburgh starts with some of the worst pain that you can imagine. And it ends with some of the best and closest relationships that uh, I could have ever hoped for. We will work together as one. We will defeat hate with love. We will be a city of compassion, welcoming to all people, no matter what your religion or where your family came from on this earth or your status. is referred to as a tree of life. It's the source of who we are as Jews. Eleven beautiful lives were cut down in our synagogue. But we're a tree of life. More leaves will grow back. More branches will grow back. We're not letting hate close our doors, ever.